Upon the NBC News team's arrival on the scene, emergency and towing services were busy recovering the truck while a few carcasses were loaded in some pickup buckies. The information on exactly what led to the accident is still sketchy, but it is alleged that the driver lost control of the truck when he tried to avoid a wild animal. A member of the Namibian Marshal Ranger was among emergency services that arrived first at the scene. The cattle truck ended up on its side. Um, some of the cattle fell out. Some of the cattle were roaming over the streets. All emergency services attended. Nampol is here. Everybody is here. Um, some of the cattle unfortunately had to be put out due to the severity of their in uh, injuries and right now they are busy with the recovery work of this truck. Mm. Uh, earlier on you told me the, the driver lost control yeah. over the truck. Yeah, where, the, where, where it was, it's on a bend. So the driver came around the bend. Now we don't know whether the, it was a shift in weight due to the fact that the truck itself was, but that will be determined when the investigator investigated. But it seems like the truck toppled over. The driver, who luckily was unharmed, said there was 128 heads of cattle in the truck and only six died. The rest of the cattle roomed into the nearby bushes and were recovered. Unconfirmed information says the cattle belonged to a farmer in Ketman shop, Johan Blow, who just bought them from an auction in Khobabes. Daniel Nadunyan, DC News, Vandu.